Our first guest, Evan McKeel, competed on season nine of The Voice to rave reviews. He was on Team Pharrell, and the Virginia-born musician music mogul dubbed him Skinny E. I wonder where that came from. Evan's new album, Brown Paper Bag, drops next Friday. He's scheduled to perform at the Richmond International Film Festival's Music Fest. Welcome back, Evan. Hi. You've been doing a lot of things since last we saw you. I have been busy, yes. <laughs> <laughs> what was it like? Because I know you, you thought about being on The Voice or auditioning for The Voice several times before you actually got there. So what was that process like for you? Yeah, so I got an, an email initially asking if I would come out to a, a private audition. Um, and I, I, was, I had to cancel because my older sister was getting married. Um, so I pulled out of that one. And then I actually did go on audition and I made it to California and I was like right about to go in front of the coaches. And one of the coaches gets sick and production delays happen and they ended up pushing my day to audition for my blind audition two weeks back onto my twin sister's wedding day. So I only have two sisters. And so that was it. That was it. So I was like, okay, last one. I'm going to go to my twin sister's wedding and hopefully I get a, a third chance. And I did and, and it worked out well. Well, let's talk about you and Pharrell and working on his team. What was that like for you? Because he's from Virginia as well. Yeah. So he had a little bit of a connection right there. That's kind of how he roped me in too. Yeah. He was like, I mean, you got to stay Virginia true. I'm like, oh, what am I going to say now? No. <laughs> um, working with him was amazing. I mean, he really, he has almost laser x-ray vision. He can see right through you. If you're nervous about something, you might even not be able to put it into words. But he's like, hmm, you need to work on this this week. That's what we're going to focus on. I'm going to pick you a song that's going to get you out of your shell. Or if someone's too out of their shell, he's like, I'm going to pick you a song that lets you be a little more intimate this time. Like, mm -hmm. He's just like a wise old sage. Every five minutes, it's something amazing you want to write down and like tattoo on your arm to save for later. Well, that's why he's such an amazing producer, mm -hmm. because he knows how to pull out of you what you can't find within yourself. Yeah, he's a, a musician's musician, for yeah. sure. Let's talk about the new album. It's coming out next week, Brown Paper Bag, mm -hmm. and you're going to do a couple of songs from the yeah. album today. What was the writing process like for you with that? Did Was it influenced by what you learned from Pharrell and The Voice and that whole experience? Yeah, it was, I mean, it was definitely influenced by The Voice. As you can imagine, being on a show like that is it's intense. I mean, you're right in a camera for a year. Um, so when the show ended, I, I just wanted to hide. I wanted to feel normal, and I just wanted a break. And I would say that like, everywhere I went um, on an emotional level, I had a brown paper bag on my head. I didn't want anyone to see me. Um, I, I went to Nashville for most of last year and just didn't see anyone. Um, and that's when I wrote most of the album, was kind of in that time that I was hiding. So it's a very introspective album. It really is kind of a a look into a very um, independent and isolated time mm -hmm. in my life. Well, one of the things you learn as a musician is collaborations, and you brought a new friend with you today. Yeah, Jonathan this is my buddy Lingerfeld. Jonathan Lingerfeld. <laughs> and how did you two get together? We met about a month ago. Yeah. Um, I have a band I've just started rehearsing with for the music festival show. And uh, we started rehearsing at a rehearsal space that's at uh, Passion Academy, the music mm -hmm. lesson center where uh, Jonathan works and teaches strings. So I met uh, him the first time I went by there with my band, and I was like, I need a violin player. Let's get together and, and jam. <laughs> and so then when I found out I was doing this, I was like, yo, yeah, our first chance to play together. together. Yeah. Come play on Virginia this morning with me. Oh, that's an amazing thing. The first song you're going to do for us is called? Love Again. Love Again. So where was that introspectively in your life? Oh, man. <laughs> I'm, it was like the rest of the album. It has some, some pain in it and some, some honesty and some vulnerability, but it's also very hopeful. All right, so now you're performing as Skinny E. Yeah. You're going to keep that, keep that <laughs> yeah. moniker? <laughs> yeah, well, I mean, you, you kind of learn when you go on a show like that, that when you're using your real name, your personal life is attached to your music. And I kind of wanted to be able to um, play the part of the artist when I wanted to mm -hmm. and then turn it off when I needed to. And so Pharrell, that, that had kind of become my name on the show behind the scenes. And I was like, well... Next time I release me music, I'm just going to be Skinny E and just run with that name. All right. Well, we're, we're here with Skinny E, and this song is called Love Again. I went away for a while To do some taking, some giving now I want to see you smile And know that my heart is still living The love we shared may seem far gone Somewhere deep inside of me I'm 
still holding on and I won't let go even when I'm wearing thin cause somehow I know I know we can Life took you up in a storm Hundreds of miles on the road Oh, you must be weary and warm Maybe it's time to come home Find some rest here in my arms to have you close to me again it can't be so far so I won't let go even when I'm wearing thin somehow I know I know Just to leave me bleeding on my own And I know that you need me I don't want to leave you all alone Come back to me And I won't let go Even when I'm wearing thin Somehow I know I know we can love again Oh, oh, oh I won't let go Even when I'm wearing That is Evan McKeel, now known as Skinny E, with Love Again. That's from the new album, Brown Paper Bag. That's coming out next Friday, February 24th. Skinny E will also perform at the Richmond International Film Festival's Music Festival on Wednesday, March 1st at the Camel. We'll put a list of all the details on our website. Just go to WTVR.com slash VTN.